At a time when prison resources are stretched, the unit has cost nearly a million pounds and is heavily staffed. Patrick Mackay has come from the segregation block at Parkhurst. He's serving five life sentences for manslaughter and robbery. Just to tell you that Mackay's arrived safely. No problems with the escort. Perhaps things have gone okay, and his personal officer's taken him for a tour of the unit now. If, if anything, I think the staff's morale is better than mine just now. The Winston McAllister argument, I think, is going to go on and on and on. <laughs> And that could end in tears, or it uh, it could resolve itself. But they're kind of like two icebergs that uh, aren't rushing to be melted. Do you know mm -hmm. Red Seas, Joe the Greek? Frank Winston is serving life for murder. He was here a week, and they shanghaied him from me. He went to Manchester. I was at Manchester, and I lay down with him. Yeah, Just I, like... I, I'm not certain. I think I think I heard the name. Yeah. yeah. What about um, uh, Albany? You ever been Albany? Albany, yes. I was at Albany in 19. Uh... 1986, uh, I think I was at Albany for a short period of time. No, I wasn't there too long actually. Uh, I didn't particularly like the. Still on control lock, Albany, yeah. it? Not anymore. They've, they're back on the keys. I thought they were on like only six at a time, slot out. Over the riots. Well, I got there just after the riots. It's very much an experimental thing. Uh, the proof of the pudding will be come back in 12 months' time. If, there's a, a number of inmates who are getting stuck in and making good progress. We can put an argument to the prison department that this way of dealing with inmates is a good one, a positive one. Um, there'll probably be further units built. If it doesn't work here, however, uh, with all the resources that we've got and the high staffing ratio that we've got, I think it could well be back to the drawing board and the prison department might think it's not been worth the investment. These people have been fighting um, the system for a long, long time. When they come here, we don't fight back. We try and negotiate things through. Uh, so we may have to give a little bit of ourselves away. We say, right, so you don't want to clean, but will you do something else? Will you do this for charity? Will you do that for, for another cause or whatever? Okay. We'll do our therapy, yes, yeah, okay. <laughs> When they look for an argument, they won't find one. Where normally, perhaps, it would have been nicked in another establishment, they don't get nicked in here. Um, but it's not just about that. It's about the fact that we get them to explain their behaviour away. We talk them through it. Don't be too precious with it. Brush it around a bit. Attitudes may stay the same, but as far as possible, we, we, we try and change their, their behavior to something that's more acceptable. At the end of the day, they're going to have to go back to a dispersal um, on normal location and survive there. at the time of the offence, you were a psychopath or behaving psychopathically. From the point of view of somebody who is supposedly using that label to enjoy taking human life, there was never, ever any suggestion in my mind that I was ever a psychopath, if one wants to use that criterion. I could have perhaps understood some people being rather uncertain as to whether or not I was, but I certainly have never considered myself psychopathic if one takes the criteria that one gets a special enjoyment out of killing, no such enjoyment have I ever had. 
I have never found any pleasure out of any such thing. should be a gradual thing. I think we've, we've, we've said that we'd expect you to be with us at this time next year. Yes, sure. Beyond that, you know, we can't ever really say because that's something that, that we debate amongst ourselves and talk about with headquarters. Are there any problems with the other inmates whilst you've been, been here? <clears throat> not? No. Well, not as yet, anyway. <laughs> to be accurate. Are there um, any concerns that there might be? Not particularly. No. But I, I can't read the future anymore.